Hey folks, Matt from ArtOfTheImage.com. Got an email in here from Man Maninder. I hope I'm saying that right. Uh, hey, I saw your last video about the Nikon D7200. Loved it. Now the problem. I'm unable to decide between the Canon 77D and the Nikon D7200. I'm on a budget here. If I go for the 77D, then I can afford it with the 18-55 to kit lens and the 50 f1.8 prime lens. And if I choose a 7200, then I can get it with the 18-140 to or 18-105 to kit lens only. No prime lens with this one. The D7100 uh, is almost the same price as the 7200 here. I've used the 33 earlier, the Nikon D3300, borrowed it from a friend for three months. I used it primarily for photography and tried making videos for twice or thrice only. But then, again, I'm going to travel this year a lot, so maybe I'll make more videos, time-lapse, slow lo mo, etc. Help me, buddy. And uh, so that is from Man Minder. I hope I'm saying that right, and thank you for your question. Interesting. Um, I would say that because it sounds like you are interested in doing more video, that I would go with the 77D in this situation, or an 80D. Uh, refurbed at about the same price because you can get them for that too or used. Uh, the reason I would do that is I like the Canon, as I've said before, better for video than I do the 7200. The 7200 is a phenomenal photography camera and I would have no questions or problem recommending it as a solely photo photographic tool. In other words, you just want to shoot photos with it. It's okay for video, but the 77D with its articulated screen and its dual pixel AF, it's just, it's, it's a much better video camera. So, and it's also a very strong, very good competitor in photography. So as soon as you just throw video into the mix, um, the 77D is coming out ahead in my opinion, and that's the route I would go. I would get the 77D. I wouldn't get the 18 to 55 lens. I would somehow finagle it, whether it was a 77D or an 80D refurbed, and I would get the 18 to 135. There's nothing wrong with this lens. Here it is here that came with the, the SL2 that I have sitting there. It's just, I think the 18 to 135, you can usually get it for a little bit more money with a kit or used, and it gives you much more reach, and I'd rather have it. And then I, the 50mm f1.8. If this is what you can get for now, the 18 to 55 and the 50mm f1.8, no problem. And you can sell the 18 to 55 later and move into uh, the rest. I mean, my favorites of, of the best value lenses from Canon for that camera is a 10 to 18. Love that lens. The... 50 f1.8 STM, which is on the SL2 there, the 55 to 250 IS STM, which is right here, and uh, then I like the 18 to 135. But the setup I have here with the SL2 is with the 18 to 55, as you're suggesting, because that's the kit it came with. So it's an all right setup. I just happen to like the longer reach on the 18 to 135. I think it's a better walk around lens for the focal length, the extra zoom. So that's what I would do. I'm going to throw it back to you guys. What would you do? Do you agree with me? Would you go with a 77D or a used 80D? Even an SL2 I would maybe consider. I, li I really like this SL2, by the way. So let me know what you guys would do in the comments below. Um, what would you do and why? Let's help out Man Mender, help him make this decision. Uh, always good for our viewers when they're writing in to get uh, you know advice from various people. Sometimes you bring up points that I hadn't thought of, uh, and then you get to flush it out more when you're making your decision, which is better for our viewer. Thanks again for your questions. Stay tuned. Looking forward to hearing what you guys have to say. Back soon here at artoftheimage.com.